Hello everyone, thank you very much for interest on my poster. My name is Yi from University of Southampton. Me and my colleague, we did a short-term research project last year on the battery-free smart bandage. As you know, the bandage originated as a barrier that simply stopped dust, dirt, and other environmental contaminants getting into a wound. Recently, bandages began to incorporate electronic functionalities and is named as smart bandage. A smart bandage aims to monitor wound conditions and report to healthcare practitioners to allow an informed decision on treatment without inspecting the wound. A smart bandage may also be used as patient with an NFC-enabled smartphone. To achieve the bar proposed smart bandage, you need to contain sensors which are used to monitor the healing of the wound to the skin. Typical parameters which is desirable to sense are temperature, humidity, pH, glucose, pulse, and oxygen saturation. Near-field communication, NFC, and ultra-high frequency, UHF, communication, RFID, are the two most widely used commercial implementation of RFID technology. The performance and the benefit of each suits different specialized applications. The detailed comparison is shown in Table 1 in the poster. In this work, we focus on the work of battery-free smart bandage development via NFC technology. Then Milexis 90129 was chosen for our device, since a comprehensive evaluation board is available. Based on the Milexis RFID transponder, we realized a battery-free smart bandage it can monitor skin wound temperature and humidity. The, the battery-free smart bandage is powered wirelessly by the NFC technology and uses the same technology to transmit back the temperature and humidity data. The investigation started from coil design. We have a fixed dimension of coil, which was restrained by the commercially available bandage plaster. Based on the equation 1, we can work out the optimum inductance value of the coil. Then there is another equation to calculate the coil number of turns, weight, and gap to achieve the 1.837 microhenry. Therefore, any size coil can have an optimized and customized design to match up the Milexis transponder inductance requirement. Different coil design or prototype on a mill PCB board. You can find it in figure 1. Then the best design is chosen based on the practical measurement of inductance value. At the same time, a miniaturized humidity sensor and a set of surface mount electronic components were used to design the circuit to leave as much space as possible inside the coil without affecting the plaster breathability and flexibility. Figure 1 also shows the assembled smart bandage on an adhesive bandage plaster. Initial communication between the bandage and reader has been achieved in reading the temperature and humidity sensor in hex number format. Future work will calibrate the smart bandage system and provide a user interface to interpret the live data streaming. Potentially, a smart bandage based on UHF technology will also be investigated and realized to achieve multiple smart bandage reading in long distance in meters range. This work is funded by EPSRC Medical Device and Vulnerable Skin Network Project.